As you can see, I'm here at the website of the Electronic Text Corpus of Sumerian Literature. I'm going to show uh, all of you how to search for the term Anunnaki in the Sumerian literature. You'll notice this is maintained by Oxford University. The database has 400 literary compositions that it draws from. It's all the major epics, all the major sources. Uh, you can get results in transliteration, and you can get to English translations once you've searched. And I'm going to show you how to do that. You need to make a fundamental decision. You're either going to take Zechariah Sitchin's books and take his word for what he says about the Anunnaki, and he rarely ever tells you what text he's citing. Or you can go to this website, search the term yourself. You'll be able to go to this site and type in what I'm going to type in, which you're going to see me do. Search the text corpus for yourself, get to the data, and look all of them up. And I'm supremely confident that you're not going to find any evidence at all for the translations and the ideas that he puts forth in his books and says that are in the Sumerian text. So let's get started. The first thing you need to do is click on Advanced Search. And let me make this page a little larger here at the top. In search for, you need to type in those letters exactly as I have them. This tells the search engine that it's looking for Anuna and it's a deity name. Just leave form uh, the way it is. Uh, after you do this search you can come back and play with this a little bit and sort by keyword and you're searching all the texts in the corpus. So once you've done that, just hit your Enter key. And our search is populating. It'll take a little bit of time. I don't have a super fast connection. But we have 182 hits, so 182 occurrences of the term Anunnaki. You see in green, you're going to have the various spellings, so it even catches uh, alternative sign spellings and text spellings if I can say it that way and you could just scroll down here I made a PDF of this search and put it on the website uh, it's really the PDFs not really gonna do you that good I, I or that much good I'd rather see you run the search for your, yourself because here on the left you'll notice we have uh, a numbering system here if you see TR right here my cursor is right at it that means there's a translation available now the first one there's no translation because if we click through this there's nothing to translate except the name right here it is it'll it'll pop up to the top when you click on one of those links right here we have the deity name Anunnaki so there there's nothing about the Anunnaki that said it's just a name and a list but if you come here and you click on translation, this is a larger text. You can see we have an inerta text. And right here at the top, lines 652 to 661, is our first hit, the, the hit we were navigating to, the Anuna gods. So this is how you use uh, your search results. And I invite you, uh, I challenge you, to run the search, look up all the occurrences of Anunnaki yourself, and you'll find out that uh, Zechariah Sitchin really is just not telling you the truth about the Anunnaki. He's making it up. And this is the best way to check for yourself. You don't have to take my word for it. Run the search yourself. Look at the results.